So today we're going to be showing you how to remove a, uh, a separate uh, tapered steel bushing from the uh, taper that it sits in the uh, aluminum pulley. It's just a four group pulley. Uh, pulleys are that I run into at my work are either steel or aluminum. This one happens to be aluminum, so you have to be a little bit more careful with it. And <clears throat> first off here, I'm wire wheeling the uh, face of it where the um, where the motor shaft is on. In this case, it's flush with the steel bushing. Now, sometimes um, there could be motor shaft sticking out towards you and the bushing could be further um, onto the motor shaft uh, or an, an, in a fan shaft. If this is for a, um, you know, if this is for a fan application, or if it's not on the, there's also a uh, bushing and pulley on the fan shaft, and then the pulleys are connected by a belt, so it, when the motor kicks on, it turns the motor pulley, which then um, starts rolling the belts, which is then connected to the um, the fan pulley, which turns the fan, which rides on bearings. But uh, more on that later. So now I am. Uh, I sprayed some coil, and you could spray some WD-40, whatever penetrating oil you have, into the um, the push-off threaded holes. And then once you do that, you're gonna want to want to tap through them. And I have a quarter twenty tap for, because these are uh, quarter twenty threads. And those three bolts that hold the steel bushing to the aluminum pulley. I'm gonna be taking those out shortly. And the reason I tap those threaded holes is because those bolts are the same. Uh, thread as those threaded holes and I'm going to run those bolts down through the threaded hole and it's going to go through the bushing and start to push off the end of the bolt will start to push off against the aluminum pulley and that's how you push off a pulley off of a bushing in, in this tapered setup so um, I'll uh, let the video roll and we will get into, you'll see the rest of it. And if you have any questions, you let me know in the comments below. And this is a how-to. This may not be super useful for many of you, but I just thought it would be interesting to see what I get into when I'm at work. So enjoy. Sound. Should I breathe it in? Absolutely. Turns into Iron Man, you know? Oh. Oh, nice. Everything's good and smart now. It's good. <laughs> it's got Iron Man. You want to hit it 
as close to the middle or the inside as possible. Play it where it's strong, it's right where it's Like right there? Yeah. Yeah, like that I is like good that. because, yeah, that's a good, that's a good way to hold. If you hit it out here, you will, this will eventually crack. Uh -oh, even okay. with aluminum. Even with aluminum. And then hit it as close to the bulb as you can, too. As close to the oh, because you're... Like that? You gotta be careful not to have it strike the bolt, especially out like that because it'll bend it. Okay, we got some movement. I had to run a tap in and there's no uh, sit screw either.